Spencer, my boxing buddy. How you doing, buddy? You look spiffy. Wow. Thank you for inviting us to, you know, me and Olivia to this great party. We're having a great time. I'm not. What? Hey. Hey. Spencer, you okay? Go away. I don't want anyone to see me like this. Well, you know, buddy, when you're friends inside the boxing ring, you're also friends outside the boxing ring. So you can talk to me. I'm your Uncle Sonny, right? I've lost your Uncle Sonny. I've lost the love of my life. Cameron, that sneak stole it from me. Cameron, what you're saying is you crumpled up the paper heart that Cameron gave Emma. It was cheesy. I gave it that beautiful fabricated egg. It came all the way from Russia. My ancestors saved it from the Bolsheviks, and she let someone break it. Maybe she didn't do it on purpose. That egg cost a fortune. And even though she let someone break it, I would have bought Emma another one. Doesn't she know I could buy all the happiness in the world? Can I be honest with you, Spencer? Man to man? Um, Cameron didn't steal Emma. I think you drove her away. So money isn't everything. You know, girls like Emma, right? Beautiful, classy, smart. Girls who are worthy of your love, they don't, they don't care about expensive things. What do they care about? What a good girl cares about, what's important to a good girl is a good man, somebody who's humble, who's confident. They don't like guys who brag. You know what girls really don't like? Guys who destroy other people's artwork. So you're saying that's my fault? You made a mistake. We all make mistakes. I've made, I've made uh, plenty lately. But you know what you gotta do with that mistake? You gotta make sure you don't do it again and you gotta make sure that you're better next time. Don't want to be in next time, Uncle Sonny. She was the only girl for me. Hey. Miss Drake, better? Yes. Thank you. Uh, you want to get back to the party? It will be a welcome distraction from the crushing disappointment. Thank you for picking me. It was a no-brainer. On second thought, I don't think I'm in a party mood. Can you make it my excuses to my father and his lovely fiance? Yeah, I'll do that for you. Hey, listen, Spencer, you gotta understand something, okay? I know you're not gonna believe what I'm saying, but it will get better. You understand me? Thank you.